Star Tackle is coming. The eleventh hour is here. We're gonna go for that Coconut Master, and nobody's gonna know. Nobody's gonna know why. <laughs> nobody's gonna see this. I'm happy. I'm waiting. You guys are. You guys are excited too to see the eleventh hour. Well, hello, Nogos and the Frenchels. It's Donald. Welcome back to my kitchen. Man, on today's menu, I'll be serving you hippos, which I think are very dangerous creatures in the wild. Even crocodiles don't want to mess with them, so you know, yeah, they mean business. But on today's menu, we're just going to be doing Hippaldon from Ultra Prism, which, well, Hippaldon himself is not uh, maybe the greatest. It has enough stats to get by. We're going to have some fun with them, but the real big ingredient to take away, something you can proof all your fighting decks with. Put one of Paltos in. We're gonna do that from now on. Now that I've experimented with it, I know this is a trump card. This is a card that will win you games with fighting deck. So we'll get to that later. Let me tell you, you know, explain to you what I'm trying to accomplish with this Apalton deck, and then you're gonna see me uh, use it in about four, four something. I think they're awesome matches. Yep, with the uh, Apalton here. So let us get started. Let me tell you about him. Wait, today's intro. Today's intro is a new remix, which if you know what it is, you know why it may make sense for this deck. And then if you know what it, really know what it is and watch the TV series. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Let's get started. Hip powder, you're the main ingredient today. Here we go. Stage 1, 140 hit points. You passed the Banana Master test, who was a basic. And if you're stage 1 and not a GX, you should have more or equal to banana master so that's good why it's difficult for you know many gx attacks to one shot this they have to use a big gx attack to get rid of this so as let me show you example like in rock gx there's only a hundred and ten that's why we say check the banana master test mm -mm, you're not gonna one shot this and if you two shot this it two shots you back yeah, that's not a good trade. Yeah, so you're kind of like, you're trying to be a GX Pokemon. Now, first attack here, very easy to do. One double colorless, one fighting energy, 50, not enough. Choice Man, 80 damage, not enough. Strong Energy, 20 more damage, 100. We're getting there. So, we, we need to help it a lot out for this first attack. And they can't retreat. This sometimes helps. I found that a little bit early, well, into the matches. You'll see where that does. But it also has a more reliable final attack that's just expensive. Too expensive. However, it's two, one more fighting energy, two fighting energies, one double colors. Not too bad. 100 base damage and 10 more for every retreat cost your opponent's Pokemon has. What's the problem? The scaling too low doesn't matter. In fact, if, if you just have one retreat cost, that's usually enough to get a two shot on a stage one GX. Yeah, he's a little bit less, but it does not matter. It does not matter. So, it has enough stats to get by. It's nothing too special piled up, but it's baby form. Gives you the game winning move. Hippautas. Here we go, 90 hit points were basic, yeah. The 11th hour tackle. Ooh, I love that name. One fighting energy, one double colors, 50 base. Huh, it's not so bad, but when you have three or less cards in your deck, it does 180 total. With this choice man, that's 210. With this strong energy, that is 230. And you add more, you can delete anything when you reach this condition. However, you're gonna be fighting, you're gonna really gonna you know, try to win without this, get as many prize cards as you can, and then, and then, at the last moment, bring this out to switch, get that last KO. I mean, it sounds hard to do, but it's not. The way this deck and most decks are set up, will go, you plow through your deck like nothing. So, you're gonna have, of course, some uh, capable fighters, you're gonna wear down the normal way. It probably should be two Lycan Rocks and... Not so many of these guys, but uh, we'll talk about that at the end. Finally, energies! You can't just wait that long to get energies. You need some help. Carbon Break's gonna help you with energies. It's one of the best ways to get energies for fighting decks. Diamond Gift, attach two energies from your discard. 
any two energies from your discard to your fighting Pokemon. So we are going to try to get strong energies. They're fighting energies with 20 damage boost to any of the attacks they do. What else? Double colors energies. It counts. Two of... You know, any energies, and it syncs with both Lycanroc and Hippowda. By the way, let's talk about your, I suppose, your other trump card. GX Lycanroc. So, he's also stage one. He's a GX, so he's got 200 hit points. Which, you know the difference between 140 and 200? It's not too much. He'll survive some of the more bigger attacks, but they both will survive two hits. Yeah! He's also got a very good ability. Extremely good. It pulls out any of your opponent's bench Pokemon right to the front and you get to KO them with your GX. Now your GX is dependent on your opponent's bench, on their bench space. So about three is, you know, we can do a three with our damage boost. Four, yeah, you're getting a KO. So three and four are your magic numbers on how many bench Pokemons your opponent has. All right, so it only is two energy, so it's so, so easy to get up. So that, that's going to get you an instant kill. So you just need one more pr prize guard. I would say one more prize, one more GX Pokemon to KO, which you have the resources to do that. Afterwards, the 11th hour, you're going to be trying to build towards this and win the game. All right, so those are our main Pokemons. Anything we should talk about? Let's see, any special tech that I have here that's you know not reused in most decks. We have the Heavy Ball. Because it gets Baby Hill Paltas and the Bigger Paltas. They both have big retreat costs. Four. Three. So the Heavy Ball gets both. Convenient. We just only got one of those because it only works for those Pokemon and nothing else. So you don't have too much. Let's take a look. We have a Broken Parallel City. It hurts Lycanroc GX, but it hurts their setup more. So I'd say it's worth it. Okay. If not, we can also use uh, Brooklyn Hill too. But Parallel City, I hate to go this... I hate to deal with it. You cannot remove Parallel City with Parallel City, so if yours is down, it's a little trickier for them to take away. What else? I think those are all the major tech. So, Kapaldon, you're an okay attacker. We're gonna make you work with Karbink. And then while we're doing this, we're gonna build towards the 11th hour and try to clutch the game with us. So, that is it. Let's get started. Kapaldon, here we go. Don't miss this first match. Yeah, nice. Nice hand. Actually, I don't get to keep this hand because uh, these combo chain into so much and deck thin, but please, I take it back if it's not a nice hand. I, guess I think it has to go get reshuffled. Arctic Fox, Metal, we may see that in the Karazma. How are you going to do with Hapaldon? How is Hapaldon going to deal with you is basically if it's that. Sogaleo is a stronger, much stronger version. You wouldn't know until you try it. Oh, oh, we have to send with you first? Oh, well that stinks. I only had one Coco then last year. And and it was the one that came out. Never mind, I changed my mind. This is no good. But we'll get going. I'll have to get it done. So welcome to another actually this is the very first of Paladin match. Number one, number uno. I'm gonna play my remix of simple and clean. From Kingdom Hearts. Hey, new one's coming this year. Yeah. Alright, I know what this year's up to. Well, you know what? Everybody hates this. I'm gonna throw it down right away. I hate this. We're gonna deck then right now. Empowdon? Yeah, you can evolve so I can make use of those Empowdon cards. We'll throw this off as well. Put the DC right here. Oh, man, I have Sycamore, Professor Sycamore, and Lycan Rock. Then we're gonna need to have to recycle that. Yeah, I'll fight with this card. There's a Guzma there. I might just save and hit that, but I don't got an energy. I really, really have to play, uh,. Play that Professor Sycamore for the extra hand. So you see, I want to be able to play, you know, evolve my Carbinks. I got to draw support right now. I may not need the Banana Master. Then again, I may regret it. So we've got to do this right now. We'll take a look at the damage right here. Goosebun and Lycanroc are two big ones. And I guess, yeah, I can Super Rod. Now? Now? Not too much. That's too early. That's too early. All right, that is that right there. I have an aggressive Coconut Master. Yeah, with the DCs. It's like, yeah, I got more of that. I can do 80 damage and stuff, too. Now, if I get it the first prize, I'll trigger his GX, and that would suck. That's one of the big the bad things. That GX triggers way too easy. He's like, ha, you do it too early. Yeah, if he didn't have some way to remove that, then I would uh, shrug his bench. So, overclock. Ah, no draw supporter. But overclock gets you more cards. Okay. Okay, so we have Guzma. That's the big bad thing right there. But I don't have a float stone to combo with that. 
So I probably have to go to the front. I would love to finish this off. But nobody can finish it off. So let's charge. I think Carbine would be next to go in the battle. However, let's make sure we have a good, nice, big attack, right? Carbine can come in any time. Let's get a pound on up, too. All right, no Guzma. I will let you live, Bang Bite. I know you're the biggest, big, big, big thing out there. So we're going to go ahead and play Cynthia right now. Two removal? Yeah, you don't want to let him keep that stadium. And you know what? We'll parallel city you again. That's my only other parallel city, but that's okay. Fake, keep doing that. I'm not going to let you fill up Coconut Bass or your, your stuff out. Carbink? Yeah, go ahead and get that up there. Punch it! Energy drive! Angry Coconut Master! It's like, feel the wrath of the coconuts. And he's throwing coconuts at the the, the, the Guardian of Time. He's like, this is a bad, normally a bad idea. He's like, nope, I got all the two removals. Your parallel city will not counter me. So Ultra Ball, gonna get a, a nice stuff out. Ooh, um, two Magnezones have to go. Well, that means if I finish off that Magnezone, you're in trouble. I don't know, you gotta recycle and uh, land, all the, land all the magic stuff there. It is Banana Master. There is no Coconut Master. Unless, unless something's up. We'll keep watching, though. We'll keep waiting. So he still can attack again. He's got definitely got a bad... I see. I see. You know what? Two here. That means that's your only one. You now have a lot of hit points. And the combo can get ridiculous. He can do Papa Random Timeless now. I have to be afraid because energy is unlimited at the moment. And he still has not any supporter. He's like, dang. Oh, there we go. There's the Shana. There's the Shana. So gotta be careful. If he drops, if he just pulls enough energy, his timeless GX could go off. But if it does go off, we probably lose two prize cards. Three. No, 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 we'll be okay. It's okay. Retreat? No, it's like I can't attack. Nope, you're too little, too weak. Well, I'll safely up and charge up for a timeless. Okay, I see how it is. Now, if you put too many energies up, then I will just Guzma that there. Really? Save it. Save it. Don't do it this turn. Do it the future turn because now if I had another energy card I would finish this off with a Guzma with the Guzma right here, but I don't I don't I shouldn't have done this. I need to feel blower to get rid of that stadium he has But it's okay. It'll still work out But in a master it's time for you to show you show yourself. Show us uh, the bananas here. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and do this here. Banana master, you get the last spot. Oh, you got a strong energy. That's good. Strong energy. Let's just play it before we do anything else. The pound on. You want to have this? You know, why not? Why not? You just need one energy and you're up. Let's go ahead and play Professor Cynthia. Professor Cynthia. Yes, I'm playing Professor Cynthia now. All right, we're just gonna use energy drive. We're kind of slow ourselves. Ah, ah. Oh, Alright. Thing is, when this thing goes down, we're good. We're probably going to see a GX, though. We are probably going to get hit by a GX. And let's see. His only does up to 80, so... Mm, don't send the car bank out after it does this. There's the stadium. That's why it's like, don't you should have not Ultra Ball that. You don't have anything to remove that stadium now. He's down oh, free. Woo, look at that. Both parallels and both field blowers. Because you Ultra Balled it. Okay, check back in chat now. Uh, there's no, luckily there's no four times weakness in this game. Yeah, at least in standard there isn't. Okay, moving on, moving on. Five energies. He's like, I can do timeless. I can do more. So timeless, I'll survive the first attack of timeless. But uh, let's see, this thing has 120 damage. Yeah, he'll come, he'll come. Maybe he'll use this for retreat energy. Timeless GX, two big moves in one. Okay, so somebody has to go out. Timeless GX! Boom, you're gonna get hurt. Luckily, this says the float zone and not a choice man. Ooh! I'm kinda happy for this guy. I'm kinda happy anytime a timeless GX has been able to pull off. I'm very happy for you. He's loading up Magnusol as the final attacker. I know that's the mass last Magnusol. Dude, go to Masters. Like I can survive the time. Yeah, I'm still alive. But his turn goes again. So, Ooh, that's that. Pokemon fan club. We're gonna see the real deal comes out. Probably Necrozma's gonna come out now too. Hey, look at these uh, fans. Yeah, 
I don't know, I'm sure these are nice people. I'm gonna scare them at the same time. That kid's gonna be probably gonna grow up to be a doctor or something. Yeah, yeah. Or maybe he'll be a... I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, he's gonna be a doctor one day who grows up. Just, 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 just putting it out there. There's the Grosmas, there's the Sogaleo, because you gotta get the energies back up. Shed, finish this off. We'll take, we'll probably have to finish it off, but if we take this out, he's in trouble. So, uh, let's see, did I throw Coconut Mass? That's two, yeah, that's Coconut Master's gone. Well, this is gonna finish it off, so we'll have to do that. Alright, let's go. Play this. Play the Super Odd. Yep, we are need going to recycle our coconut masters. They'll be here. Now if I want to ultra bomb pull and pull at the back heart, I can do that. I can do that. The problem is, can I finish this in the next move? It would really hurt him. But he does have this to make it back up. And I want to finish off this because it's, uh, you know, it's everything there. Okay. You see if I go for this, he still has this. a tough choice, man. I can finish this off. It's Sand Tomb. Wait a minute. I didn't need another energy, did I? I just like... I thought I had enough damage. Wow. No, you needed that Dust Cannon. You need a Dust Cannon. You forgot about that. Dust Cannon was the thing move I thought I had, because I had enough. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. This is not good. That means he'll be able to escape. Scotch free with the GX. Charge up. I think I'm falling, going to fall behind because of that. Yes, you are, Donald. Yes, you are. So, does he have 140 damage? Yeah, with that Magnus Zone! Yeah, he'll do anything he wants. Infinite, 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 infinite. Now you're behind with that. <sighs> That's not good. Yoga Palkia, yeah. I think that move will bust me for the whole game. Yeah, you had the one. You had the. You had a lethal move too. But we'll have to worry about that later. He'll be if he attacks with Corona attack. It's enough to cle easily clean this out too. Ah, he caught up momentum. We should have done something that turn. It's too late to worry about that now. Four energies and two banana masters. Like I do not need coconut master. Everything here is fine. Shed. Oh, not gonna finish it off. Get a free retreat to save this. Oh, might have a chance now. Maybe, maybe. Okay. You need to do this. I don't. That's that. That stinks. But you have to. I'm gonna pull up the pal pad right now. Pull out Cynthia and and Guzma. We're gonna go ahead and play Cynthia here. We're gonna finish this off. That I'm gonna have a free bench space soon, so I'm gonna thin. Let's get Lycan Rock. Lycan Rock can that pull me. Uh, can combo to something big later. This is too many energies, but there's nothing we can do. Oh, he had Sand Tomb. That's why he couldn't retreat. He had Sand Tomb on him. Well, in that case, we didn't need the energy. Oh, man. Oh, man. Dust Cannon. What are you doing, Donald? You could have potentially got this another uh, pound on up. Uh... Yeah. Okay. I know. That's why. That's why. That's why. Sand Tomb stopped this retreat. It's like, why can't I retreat my Flintstone? Whoops. Okay. So now we know what that way meant. Get there. I'll get there. All right, so this will be three prize cards. This will probably be another prize card soon as well. However, if he's using uh, the Corona Impact, he can't attack again, and he may have to uh, something else for that. So this is giving me a pain. It is a pain in the butt by leaving this alive now. Now, by uh, able to use the Spirit Tomb, yeah, could uh, could, could do something again. So this is gonna charge up somebody, and that somebody is gonna be a pound on. No, actually, I still have my GX. I could charge you up. It's a bit a little worrisome if he has a Guzma in his hand, so we'll uh, worry about that afterwards. Energy retrieval. Now, it's like, oh, I don't want this right here. I probably made just Professor Sycamore. This gets me closer to the 11th hour tackle, which I might be able to pull off. Woo! 
Energy circuit. At least he won't be able to pop his GX. Three energies up, four energies. So good, Leo. Corona impact. That goes down. Okay, what do we do? We're gonna charge her for a big uh, Lycan Rock. Just kill, KO. I think that's the best move right now. I don't, don't need all these straws here. I'm gonna thin the, my deck though. I'm gonna thin. I'm gonna pull out another Paladon. Put it up. We're gonna play Professor Sycamore because we want to get close to the 11th hour. All right, Carbink. Choice ban. We'll give it to you. You don't need it, right? No, you don't need it. You do. You can have a float stone. Still thinning. Still thinning. All right, I'm gonna lose a prize card somewhere, so we'll save. Uh, we'll save it. Diamond gift. Go. Two energies, strong energy, and this onto the Lycan Rock. All right, so now he can retreat, though. He can retreat. He'd probably be able to. It's worth it. And if he goes for this, that kind of stinks. That means I would have to do it again. Actually, that would really, really badly stink. It would stink. We're trying to go for this instead of this because that. I think if I go for that, I might activate his condition. Uh, no, it wouldn't. No, it wouldn't. But hey, the threat's up. You're a pain in the butt. Because I have to worry about everything else and stuff, uh, and stuff, the things I need to worry about. So, alright, that has a one shot. Probably this is the bigger threat over this. Oh, no, you feel the pain of this. That comes out right away. To do what? Are you going to solar eclipse? You can't solar eclipse. You're going to Meteor Tempest this? Now, he, he, if he had Guzma, I think he would have Guzma that right away. This is so weak. This is weak. Professor Sycamore, it is not a Guzma. It is not a Guzma. A lot of those cards go down. And so, if we GX, we get this. And it's a strong energy. Yeah, and then we'll have to use the Carmink. Yo, so this. Basically, if once the wolf goes down, we're in trouble. Yeah, once the wolf goes down, we're in trouble. I don't see another GX where I can try to, you know, pawn it off immediately. However, I may have an 11th hour coming. All right, destroy the threat in front of you, Donald. Evolve this. Don't activate the effect, though. No. Can you activate the 11th hour? It means I don't want to activate Super Hot, then. Nor do I need to activate Super Hot. Let's see what else we can get. I want to activate the 11th hour. Professor Sycamore? Exactly. <laughs> oh, we can actually get the 11th hour next turn. Here we go! Rogue GX! You got a big bench. I got a strong energy. Take this out. What's your activated condition? The 11th hour! If you have three of your cards, viewer, you can do 180 damage. With the strong man, 200 damage. But he needs to send out a GX Pokemon, though. Yeah. Please don't have my GX Pokemon so I can win the next turn or something. Okay, Diamond hits, one shots Banana Master. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. We also have our Guzmas in our hand here. Lots of nice thinning. Uh-oh, that's a GX. That is a GX. The 11th hour. You know, you know what the makes me think most of? I'm sorry to get a bit off a tangent, but I love Doctor Who. And the 11th Doctor was the, my favorite and the first Doctor. I mean, it's your first one. He was definitely the most, yeah, of the whole Doctor Who series. He's the best doctor. He's the most interesting, interesting one. The 11th hour tackle is coming. The 11th hour is here. We're gonna go for that Coconut Master. And nobody's gonna know, nobody's gonna know why. <laughs> nobody's gonna see this. I'm happy. I'm waiting. You guys are, you guys are excited too? To see the 11th hour? Unless it gets the KO right now with with this, then I would say, oh my gosh, it's possible. It is very possible. Uh, that's what he's going for. Don't 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 take my don't take my moment away. He still wants to retreat though. Okay, sit, sit. Hang on, just sit. Radiant Star. If there are three or fewer, right? Look at my hand. Uh, there are three or fewer. <laughs> oh, 
Look at that. There are four deck cards in my deck. If I draw the third one, I can activate the 11th hour and finish this off. The 11th hour is coming, guys. I see what you're trying to do. Here we go. DCE. Pull that out. The 11th hour impelled us. I'm here. 11th hour. Go. Get that out of here. 200 damage with a squid. <laughs> oh. Score. High five. Touchdown. Go. It happened. I thought it would be harder to find that. But it happened. It happened. The 11th MVP? No, it was a pal to us. But you MVP too, little icon rock. <laughs> Welcome to another Hippaldon match. This is Hippaldon, okay? You haven't used that super deck of yours yet. I'm gonna play my remix of Despacito by Ruiz Fonzi. Little accent there, Donald. We're gonna play the Ultra Ball right now. We're gonna destroy two cards that we need. And what are we gonna send out? Let's see, who else do we need? Well, Palton, Palton's gonna have to evolve, right? Yeah, and if it, it's the baby version, great. If it's not, whatever. So, let's go ahead and recycle these. Banana Master and Professor Sycamore don't mix, because I made discard enough discarding cards that I need to use. So, without any Bridgets, I was thinking about, hey, should I, maybe I should do a Bridget opener. Nah, eh, we got enough. We didn't get energy, though. That's one reason I didn't open the Bridget over here. Yeah, we did have an energy. You discarded, you expected to draw one single energy with the Professor Sycamore 7 cards, but it didn't happen, so... Just let it be. Hey, immune nine tails. Okay, well... We'll be okay. It does 80 damage. Oh, it gets the KO on Carbink immediately. That sucks. That means we have to go for this Carbink. We don't have any energies, though. We recycled it. That kind of... Well, that's that does absolutely stink, then. Go in second, stinks. Well, I'm gonna have to buy some time. I'm gonna have to buy some time somehow. I don't want to evolve this too early either, so I'll probably Cynthia back. You go second, you lose the prize card just randomly. You just have to do deal with it. Okay. Carbink, I guess you can go up front. You'll survive a hit. We'll see what happens here. DC. I wanna... You don't can't play the DCE, so I have to toss that out. Choice Band will be good here. No, I got Weakness already, so I'm okay with losing that. Let's get you down. Well, I can rock it's not time for you to pull yet. Carbink down there. Let's well play Cynthia. Come on, Energies. I got 11, 12 Energies, total Energies in my deck. There we go. Parallel City came too. But I may want to just leave it up... There for now, or you know, if I could trick my own bench, or make him make him waste a tour move or something. Yeah, let's do that. I'll toss the parallel little city down just to annoy him. All right, and we're gonna use the diamond gift. If I had two super odds. Okay, oh, yeah, but this that can make sense. Get that DC onto, uh, you know, maybe we just get a power toss to deal with that. Because then you have to deal with that someday, somehow, right? Then again, I can just squeeze it. Uh, stop his pulls if I do this right here. And then uh, we'll get it later. Ah, let's do it. Hip out to us. There's, there's a big threat right now. We have to do take, take care of that. Yeah, yeah, we'll Cynthia again, hopefully. Man, like and rock. You like me, really like. Oh, there's a big one, too. Ooh, parallel City. Yeah, can't throw any more thing down. Okay, keeping them locked. Uh, GX. Now the GX priority goes to this. And now I do need a choice band. No, I don't. I got the strong energy. Or it might be a strong energy. So, we're gonna hold off right here. Uh, I'm gonna take another hit, unfortunately. Maybe lose two prize cards for free off the bat. The first one I had to. Second one, I still need an energy, so... Alright, holding off right here. Holding on, holding on, holding on. He's got more set up. He's gonna pull out the Rock Rough. And get the KO on it, so you lose another prize card. So now we have to recycle the Rock Rough. And the Carbink. Okay, at least they'll come back out soon. You lose two random prize cards. Boo. Boo. Okay. Field blower. You know, that's gonna sting me. So I'm gonna go ahead and take that, that, that away. 
And we definitely, yeah, I need to set, get that Lycan Rock back out. Then you can come back to Carmink, and we're gonna play Cynthia right here. Strong energy, and we can discard, discard these too. Lycan Rock, hey, comes back. We'll hold on to that. So I'm gonna discard. I don't think I need the Ella Hapaltas. I'll keep the Parallel City though. Maybe not, maybe not. Let's drop that, get the help out on up so he doesn't do the little silly trick with that again. What do I do here? The two energies is probably gonna go for the Poudon. There's only one energy, Donald. There's only one energy. I'm not, I'm not sure what my pull is either, so I'm gonna go ahead and instruct. I'm gonna pull this here. It is a heavy ball. Okay. I'm not sure when I dropped you down. When did I drop you down? Doesn't matter. I'm thinning my deck now, so I can't draw a pound on accidentally because I just have to. Well, there it is. Never mind. So we're gonna use Carbink and Diamond Gift. What is this gonna do? This gets me a strong energy wear. On the Paltos. Why not? Now you can attack. Now you gotta get worried. Yeah, kill my baby. It's like, yeah, I'm afraid of the Lycan Rock. Lycan Rock's bad. We still have the 11th hour to come in somewhere, too. Maybe, maybe. It's getting close to that 11th hour, but uh, leave it be. Let it be. Zorark's damage is limited by the Parallel City right now, so the big threat is this right here. We want to take care of that. And it's charging up. Yeah, I know what it is. So I'll retreat, because I don't want to give you any more free prize cards. Because you went first and started dominating. Just took out something for free there. He's like, God, Don Ebo's, I want Greninja Break. Ninetales Greninja. Hey, man, the, 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 the new uh, Break GX one might be good, too. Game of Choice Man right here. Gonna end. That's gonna get me a free fresh hand. And him, not so much. But he gets the extra crawls from Zorark. And there's the Lycan Rock too. Lycan Rock may show up soon. We can't just knock this out and don't care about this, because this is not a threat. This is... Aurora Beam! Ow! Alright, so here's the DCE for you. We're definitely gonna retreat. Does this is enough to take, to take out the Paladon? No. Let's just get rid of the threat now. I wanna leave it, don't leave it out there. Retreat! Then again, he may have a Guzma and do something. I have. But this is giving him extra draws? It's giving him extra draws. Yeah, I don't like you getting just two more free cards every every turn and stuff. I'm gonna thin my hand. I don't think I can evolve that, so actually I'll just use... Uh, yeah, I can. Yeah, I can. It's in my hand. It's in my hand. I can evolve that. I just need the bench space in the future, though. Now you can play Professor Sick. No, I want to keep that. I want to keep this in my hand. Actually, I don't care. It can go back. I just need more cards in my hand. Okay, we got strong energy for the future. We don't really, really, really care. I can throw this on for now to make him uh, just a thin. Just the thin. Just the thin. We're going to use Dust Cannon or Tomb. I think it doesn't matter. Yeah, it does. Dust Cannon is sure. For sure, fire KO. We want to KO it. Doesn't matter which attack. Just use the one that gets the KO. And we'll be able to pierce through the Lola Ninetales with this, too. This doesn't seem like it's ready to attack right away. So if we can get rid of this, it's be. Uh, we don't get rid of it later. We got something else. And he's not filling up his bench, so I can't GX. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Should have thought about that. They did that, but I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure the stadium is still still hurting us. Hit up. It's like, yeah, I can fit some space for Banana Master. Choice man, going on the back one. There's your real deal. There's the deal. That, there's the real one that does all the power. We may. I just let's see. He still has his GX though. His GX is still available. So if I don't one shot it, he'll just pass all the damage back onto me. And all right, I'll take it in. Oh my gosh, I don't have an 11th hour available. I evolved all the Hippalta, so that's gonna be something you gotta worry about. You... The 11th hour is not coming. I messed it up. I think I messed it up. I don't have a fourth Hippalta, and I used up all my super rods, so we have to go without the 11th hour today. Even though the 11th hour looked like it was, might be setting up soon. Woo! All right, Aurora Beam, take a bit of damage there. Uh, that that might not have a big, a big uh, enough attack to pinch me off either. Okay, but a strong energy up here too. Give you the choice, man. 
Don't have any extra pulls. I could just... That's the only thing I can do is just try to knock it out now. Go. Knock it out. KO. Oh, both Super Odds are gone. I don't have... I evolved them all too early. Yeah. Keep this... Keep this and then... You have to think about that, Donald. You have to. So we will not see him in the 11th hour this time. Nine Tails comes out. If you don't one shot it, it'll get you. It'll just GX you. But let's see. It's 50 hit points. It's going to have to pop a big attack. We'll see what we do. We'll probably soften it with a car bank first. Yeah, soften with a car bank and then uh, let it be. I'll put the, this car bank out. I'm not sure what else. I'll get out here. Professor. Oh, never mind. He had a Professor Kukui. So he doesn't need to. He doesn't need to. Uh, Blizzard. He can ice plate this. He can ice plate this for free. Two removal. Yeah. Or he can go for this. Actually, he wouldn't do that. You have to take care of that Hippaldon now. You have to take care of that Hippaldon. Ooh, it gotta be challenge. Ice Blade, Hippeldon! Okay. It would be a problem if we, uh... No, we have to... I guess we have to worry about the threat. Let's do this right here. I don't think I can evolve you in time. Nor do I want to play a Coconut Master. I just want Thin. Oh, there's Coconut Master. Okay, let's just Thin. No 11th hour, sadly. Let's, uh, let's send you up now. I have a Guzma. You want a Guzma one of the back line? Not really. I want to soften up the front line. How badly do you need the Guzma? How much can I soften this? Let's go for a Cynthia instead. Or an N. Now nah, he's got Sushi Master. Let's go for... Professor Sycamore. Thinning, thinning, thinning. Who comes out? We will see. All right, this is a good hand. Retreat. Choice man this. Diamond Gift. 50 damage. Strong energies. DCE. Put into a new Apaldon. No 11th hour, even though it's starting to set up to that 11th hour. Ugh. Ugh. 50 damage, is that enough? 160 enough for you to get the KO in the next move? It might be. He GX, you know he had to GX. You had to GX, so now I don't have to be afraid of a GX anymore. Okay, what's your retreat cause? If I lose this, I'm bad. I'm in trouble. He knew it. He's very smart, but that 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 the game took the threat away from the um, well. Now I don't have to be afraid of that. I have to end because that's a big hand of yours. That is a big hand. We'll put this right here. Now I'm gonna end. I'm gonna end. Here we go. You got Sushi Master to protect you, but I'm still don't like that. Parallel City, hurt your own damage, shrink my own bench. Yeah, let's do that. Let's face it my way. I'm gonna throw Coconut Master off the bus. You can't have access to that. The 11th hour is definitely set up now. Ooh. Dust Cannon. Yeah, you can do your 160 damage on this. That's still one prize card away for winning. That one's pretty close. Yeah, yeah. Cyrus, you get to protect two cards. Protect this, protect the carving. I know how Cyrus works now. I usually click the wrong stuff. I've been doing that a couple of times, so... You have to retreat. Because if I defeat this, I win the game automatically. And I still have a... I still... That, that did free... That said... Well, hang on. I think Coconut Master went back into the deck. No, maybe? No, one went to the discard. Banana Master went back to the deck. Where's the other Coconut Master? Somewhere. Somewhere. So it has to run. I don't have Guzma. This is getting close. I still have three prizes to go. He could... He, no, he can't let this... Go. Yeah, he could just let it go. And then I need another fighter to fight. Another Alola Nine Tails. Ooh, we need that Guzma. We need that final, final Guzma. I think I already blew the pal pad. There's one Guzma left. I know it's in my deck because I had it in my hand before. Ice Blade. He's going to soften this. No, he's going to go for the front. He didn't want to KO it. He didn't want to KO it. That was a mistake. We saw... Angry face. I made a mistake. The 11th hour is now active. And but Guzma's in my hand. Uh, we're going to get more Guzmas back, though. Guzma. Cynthia. 
Yeah, I hate it when that happens, but I'm, I can't. I'm not gonna. I have to go forward with that. He misclicked. He misclicked. We had a pound on. Really? Another one? Yeah, yeah. Well, I messed up too. I didn't. I forgot. The 11th hour was triggered. It was triggered. I could have technically set it up somewhere. So now he still has two prize cards he has to go for. And uh, he'll try to catch up after that. Oh, I'm on a 13 win streak with your Mega Gyarados Gold Duck. No way! No way, that thing's still good. Congratulations, uh, Fryer Truck. All right, two removal. That's going to take this nasty damage-reducing stadium away. Actually, maybe, did the stadium keep me alive? It could have. The stadium could have been kept me... Maybe it did keep me alive. He would have done 140 damage. I think I would have died still. Unless that's a... What kind of damage reduction is that? There should be only 20. Yeah. That's why I only did 30 damage there. So if he did pull Ice Blade, the 140 would have been... We should have been there. Alrighty then! So, Guzma's in our hand. He played Professor Sycamore. I think this is victory because Guzma's right there. Ice Blade. So we just go for Sushi Master and that's it. Okay. Smiley face. Smiley face, smiley face, smiley face. I just Guzma this up here. And bring this. And we're gonna use Claw Slash or Dangerous Slash. Now nah, he knows. He knows. Yeah, he made he made the he made the mistake of not taking out the Paladin. Then uh, he then I don't know. I still think I could pull it off even if he didn't make that mistake, but definitely helped out there. So uh, there we go. Hit Paladin. Good job for you again. Another Hit Paladin match. Today's uh, stream giveaway winner is the Cave Guy. So we uh, congratulations to the Cave Guy. It is Grass. I have weakness to grass, but that is okay. That's totally allowed. So I'm gonna play my weakness. Of, I'm going to shut up. Focus. I'm gonna play my remix of action battle because he is the last boss of the, 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 the today's stream. So let's go ahead and set up. What do we get in? We're probably gonna open with a carving since we can discard so many energies off the bat. I think. I don't know. It might be Lycanroc. Uh, to threaten him that Lycanroc can sh show up. Yeah, carving's too slow. Threaten him. Say, hey, man. I can, uh, I can do that. I want to, kind of want to Sophocles. Yet I kind of want to play Professor Sycamore. Throw choice, man. Let's just play Professor Sycamore. You want to discard stuff, and you're gonna play Professor Sycamore probably anyways. All right. Oh, we bricked into that one. No, I'm gonna go ahead and drop this uh, parallel city down. That might get me. We'll drop the DC. Here ahead of time, just to scare him. And I end my turn right there. Yeah, maybe it might be able to take a early cleave on this Aurel if nothing goes on there. Alright, Bridget Opener. Bridget Opener. It's gonna be Zorark and, and Rowlet, but the Parallel City is locking down any other bench. So this card, damage, may not be that there. Alright, so we did go first, and this is the reason why I don't like uh, going second. You just lose a prize card, and you don't really have nothing to do about that. Okay. So. In that case, nope. Take it out. Start taking prize cards out. Take it. Yeah, we don't have a draw, so. Card bank. Ah, wrong stuff. Wrong stuff. Alright. This comes out. But as long as parallel's in effect, it shouldn't hurt me too badly. Probably. Probably. They all can evolve now, so the card pools will go through. There it is. First evolution. And, oh, he wants to fight. So we'll get a two-shot, but we have weakness damage. Yeah, we both have weakness against damage against each other. Because he's uh, he has both, and the Sijuai is up now. So we'll probably get two-shot anyways. Okay. But, I need a draw. I need a draw. So if he attacks me with the Sijuai, then I do take weakness. But with this, I get both. Oh, no, this comes out. Yeah, you know you know, this guy has the weakness damage to you. So, uh, oh wait, wait, what's going on? Feather Arrow, gonna buy some time here. And this has a Float Stone, so if I want to retreat it, then I just have to remove this all myself. So, okay, we can do that. Maybe you can do that. Nope. Take that off there. Uh, yeah, you have to do it for your own Pokemon. That sinks. Retreat. Take a part of the prize card. I'm bricked. I have nothing else I can do. 100 damage. He didn't have an energy to attack with that that either, too. So, waiting on another draw. It's like, you should have, you should have Sophocles. You should have Sophocles. All right, we're two prize cards ahead, but we don't have any developed, we don't have a developed, any development at all. So I'm kind of worried. 
I'm going for the Lycan Rock. I'm just gonna lose that right off the bat. Yeah, because that has the weakness damage. Actually, a lot more has the weakness damage. Field Blower taking away that nasty, nasty Parallel City. So that'd be a good, good time. It'd probably be good. I don't wanna. I don't wanna Super Rod because that keeps that that uh, does the combo here. Ultra Ball. Yeah, we gotta do that now. Otherwise, the Lacking Rock dies. Hit Pound On, you can go. I probably need a Choice Band, too. <sighs> but right now, it's not the biggest priority. It's between life and death. Then again, it's between being stuck and not stuck, too. But I also get a two prize. I get a prize card as well, so. And I don't. He doesn't get a prize card. So now we are really stuck. It's time to super odd. No, the hell off of that. You now live. I had to give up a prize cards for that. I'm sorry, I draws for that. And this is the only KO I can get. So I'm gonna pull, pull this out here. Shut down all the Zora arcs. Okay, there's a Guzma. This is a very aggressive Coconut Master. It's not even anywhere, nowhere, nowhere, but nowhere what, uh, yeah, what, 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 what this deck should be doing. We are just have a really, 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 really weird, uh, setup. So, leaving it out here, we both have a really bad setup. <laughs> he, we, he hasn't done draws, single draws more. Donald, you can't play. You have three in your discard. But, focusing on here, Lycanroc still has the weakness, so I guess, no. We both have weakness, but this one, uh, that's, how, that's how things are going. A draw supporter, yes, yes. But remember, it's not time to super odd, because it's not time to super odd. Okay. How? We have some development. We have some development. I think I have enough to KO this already. Even if I GX, it'd still be worth it. Let's go ahead and thin this well. Banana Master, you're here? Yeah, Banana Master, extra card. It will stop his draws if I do that too, if I'm aggressive now. Go drop the Parallel City. Okay, I had the weakness damage, but effective. We both do. We both potentially could have. Drop the parallel city on to uh, hold it off there. Dangerous rogue. He's gonna stop his card pulls. This is pretty one sided. Yeah. With the angry, angry, angry coconut bastard and the brick. You know, I hate brick games. We'll probably have a redo somewhere. So, retreat. I need one more prize card. And finally, his first, first draw supporter. Cave guy. Well, we'll do this again, but let's see what we'll finish this, wrap this up to see a conclusion. So, Coconut Master comes through. However, he just played in, so we can't really play that just yet. Just, just yet. Cynthia, yeah, that's for next turn. But you know, I just need to fill the bench now. Well, if there was so arc, yeah, for damage. So, Bella Arrow, keep working on the Lycan Rock, I think. Yeah, I got nothing right now. I'll put a smiley face just to respond. But, uh, yeah, with the prize card difference, it's going to be hard to catch up, for sure. I probably need to attack. I'm going to pull some extra cards. I hurt that, so let me get that out of there. Destroy Zora Art to serve some mercy. Ouch. Okay, so that's uh, Donbei. Okay. Six more cards. I'll probably go go and destroy some cards I don't need, just to thin things out. We could probably have a pound on. Remember, keep, a, keep, a, keep the 11th hour open, Donald, for yourself. All right, here we go. Claw Slash, that's all I can do. 160 damage. If we can wrap it up with this, we're good. All right, we do have weakness damage, though. If he did some... If he, if he wasn't stuck and he got the energies, we would have to deal with that. Max Potion. Ooh, we did not expect that. Did not expect that. So we do not have a one-hit KO on the next move. Uh, what do we do, then? Actually, we do. We do. I lied. I forgot about this guy. He's sitting there. 
And there's the synth that he prepped another turn, so... Yeah, we pull this out. That was not a nothing that was that could reshuffle my hand, so I definitely will keep this. Definitely, definitely, definitely. So is there anything that can stop me? Maybe an energy removal. An energy removal and enhanced hammer would stop me, but... It's looking... Right now, the forecast is looking I can take this down the next move. Yeah, we have weakness against damage against each other. I didn't keep banging the head of the win on that, so... Banana Master, I'm sorry, this gets the energy. Coconut Master gets the energy, and he's been, he's been, he's been shot. He's got like five arrows on him the whole, his whole life. This whole game, he's got five arrows on him, so... Okay, we pull this here. We did actually could have gone for the Rowlet. I'm going to use this as a retreat because I didn't have a Float Stone, and that is going to be it. Claw Slash. We both were bricked, so we do have a redo. We have a redo for this, so uh, good game uh, this time. Yep, and let's have a rematch. Welcome to a rematch between me and the cave guy. Yeah, the Sidious Zorark versus this. So his grass Pokemon's can hit me for weakness, but my fighting Pokemon's can hit him, his Zorark, for weakness. So it's a balance. It's a fragile system here. Let's get started. So I am going to play my remix of this is the ultimate battle between me and cave guy. So good luck to you, cave guy. Let's get go. I'm going to prep myself up for a car bank. I'm less DCs, uh, that's probably the more valuable choice there. I'm gonna set myself for a rock rough too, just to scare him. Throw that down. Hey, Paladas, you go ahead and stay up there. Float stone. Do I need to get you out of here? I don't think so. I'm just gonna Cynthia. I'm gonna hold on to those float stones. I might need to retreat to the actual retreat, but just uh, not then. Alright, I don't have a draw support this time, so my uh, my draw supporters can be Banana Master once I can uh, thin a lot down. Alright, that is gonna be it. We're gonna end it right there. I guess, yeah. Ooh, not so hot this time. Well, not so hot both times. But at least we had a draw at the start there. And, uh, yep. Holding on, let's see what happens here. It does take weakness damage from me, so if I put the strong energy on, do use the 11th hour. Weakness is gonna hurt this poor type of Coco. Oh yeah! Good old bridge and opener! Here it comes, opening up! And... Bench is gonna become full of Decidueyes and Zoroarks. Alright, so I think that's a bigger threat. He does have the DC to hit my bench. So, do we want to stop the Zorark out? Or do we want to... Let's see, if I play Guzma, I don't gotta retreat anyway. So you don't have a choice. You have to take the weakness damage and go. I'm bricked, so I have to take him out. Now he still can take me out with the... Uh, if this evolves and gets a DCE, then I would be behind there. Yep. It now falls to me. Actually, no, a DCE on this will do, do good just fine too on both cards. DCE is like, ha! Huh? Not this time around, Donald! And yeah, both were here. So both could have done it, but you know, don't expose your guy, your Zorark. Send the Coconut Master out. Na, 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 na. I can't shrink my hand that much. Not what this what this have right here. Energy drive. Alright, between Lycan Rock and I guess I could give up the Lycan Rock. I could quarter it. Everything would die though, except this card. This card would not die. Buy me more time with the I'll use with the prize card deal. Nope. You brick. You brick. You could goose to buy time. He'll have to retreat. have to retreat. Can you shrink your hand enough? No. You know, I need to buy some time. That thing is a sure shot on me. Let's pull this out. Let's pull this up here. Uh, who gets the energy? Nobody else does. Yeah. We're gonna wait for it. We're gonna wait for the... Uh, yeah, just, just gonna go. It's uh, my turn to get brick now. Lodestone! No, I had a retreat, Donald. I'm coming out to get ya. He needs one more energy to get the KO and the carving. And I think that's it. Cynthia. Cynthia goes. Six more cards. He just needs one energy to get the KO and carving. Oh, that's another prize card down. Rare candy. First Decidueye comes out. Nope, don't need to run another energy. Decidueye is just enough. And that was meant to slow him down, but no, he had a float stone ready. Okay. Ultra Ball. What is our comeback potential? It's rough. I'll be 
That's the fourth prize card. That's the third prize card. That's a KO. All right, something's gonna happen, like magic. We need some magic to happen with the next carpool, right? Right, Banana Master. Here we go. Parallel City down. Stop uh, any more bunch of Pokemon from going through. There's a float stone, so we'll go ahead and take that off. Not the Parallel City. Energy. Okay, this is more valuable energy card. Super odd. Yeah, let's go ahead and recycle. Let's so recycle. We have to click everything, but you know, energy is less there. Draw a supporter. Let's go. Let's go. Let's let's go. There it is. Free retreat. Throw down for thinning. S Cynthia. Catch up time. Okay, that's that. I really hope that I had a carving, but uh, it's my deck now. Yeah, I'm not gonna expose anything else. This involves he's in trouble too. But I need to make sure I have to, I don't know, I have to pull the actual card. Mallow, any two cards you want. So that is not going to be a uh, Guzma. That is not gonna be a Guzma. Guzma is like, oh no, I lose my Lycanroc. Lycanroc's my guy to get this guy. And then, if this evolves... Oh, he's got already got that. He's already got that. He gets a Decidueye, two Decidueyes out. He's not going to evolve in time. Well, never mind about that. Second Decidueye coming down. Two snipes. Poor, poor, our poor puppy. I was like, that was my, that was my victory move. And then, uh-oh, they're coming. Ow, my puppy. Goodbye, goodbye, like a rock. Arrows is like all game, but he would he would live last time. This time around, we uh we <laughs> nope. Okay. Well, he did. Next turn, Banana Master goes. What do you do? I guess you could Sophocles. I better do that. Four more cards. Over seven. Let's go for us. Let's go for s let's go for seven. I don't need these cards in my hand. I think I don't need these cards in my hand at least. Give you some retreat as well. Let's go. No, Sophocles. Not this time. Yes, last time, but not this time. Hmm. Nothing else I can do. I'm gonna go ahead. And, I guess I'll just go ahead and play the pal pad. Rake myself up with more Guzmas and more uh, more Sycamores. Ooh. But we don't. Wow, we're not hitting the draw supporters as well this time around. So let's go ahead and play the heavy ball. I can't get that. Yeah, these are the only two choices. So yeah, just start doing this to start thinning. I don't want to give up Banana Master just yet. He might be good, important for the card pulls. Ugh, this is lame. This is lame, 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 lame. So he might, my, my, he may be my last hope for pulls. Lodestone? Nope. Send that to the back. I think, I think, yeah. Guzma, the, the threat out. Mm -hmm, mm, out the right away, right off the bat. Well, I get weakness damage against this, but he may have enough damage to get the KO. Feather arrow, deal with the threat right away. Yeah, yeah, okay. Well, we were gonna pull that out in the first place. Sand Tomb's damage is not enough, even with the weakness damage, I need 100. I need a hundred, but it's gonna hurt it. At least it's gonna hurt it. So, to keep momentum, I need a carbing. There it is, there's that carbing. There's no way I can escape, so I have to pull the damage right now. We're doing this to thin our hand, because we have no draws, supporters. So, we're, come on, one extra card. Let it be something nice, let it be nice. Uh, that's, something, that's nice enough, I need it. I need the extra cards. Goodbye, Guzma, I've got extra, you know, extra, and it's not, it's not goodbye. Goodbye just yet. Let's go ahead and play uh, Cynthia. Instead, Professor Sycamore. Keep my Guzma. Alright, do you want to recycle anything now? I guess I want to scare him with a Lycanroc soon. No energy, so. That's okay, Lycanroc's coming back. Can I evolve some stuff? Is the 11th hour available? In the future for me, at least. Hang on to that, then. Hang on to that. Sand Tomb. Weakness damage. 140. So with 70, we could get it out. With 70. So it means you need a strong energy or a choice man there. So he's gonna get the KO on this. That means he gets a free hit too. He gets a free hit on one of my Pokemon. So probably to be Tapu Lele, which is bad. Yeah, but nobody... We have to. We have to. We bricked. 
That's just Hebert last time. Move it! Do the best you can! Yeah! Hippalitas is taking the... Uh, well, not not this guy. It's like, I'll take you whenever I want to. But potentially another free prize card could be coming from there. Right is beating. Alright, 80 damage. So that goes really, really goes down. We're in trouble. So 80 damage? Who can do 80 damage right now? I'm not sure if I can evolve you. If I lose this, I'm gone. So I think I did. This is a straightforward 80 damage. This is for thinning purposes. I'm gonna keep the 11th hour open by not evolving that. And shrink is down all the way to minimum now. He still has these arrows to finish this off, so I'm in trouble. Let's drop these out. There's no way I can fill up my bench anymore. Let's get that this guy up so I can get some energies in the future when I need to need to retreat. But those those will probably put a big timer on my uh, life shelf life. All right, especially that I need more damage even still. Yeah, I'm not gonna have too much time left. I'm not gonna have too much time left. Two prize cards. Dang, if I had a, one more prize card, yeah, this comes out. Okay. We have to run it away immediately, too. Four energies? No, you ain't got time. Those decision will snap you out of here. This is it. This is it. This is... His... Well, yeah. It is it. Float zone. Sorry, field blower. Yeah, this stadium is the worst. If only we could stop these things from shooting, but no. They'll get They'll get me. Feather arrow, probably just focusing the, this one, because this is going to be the weakest soon. So it does 120 damage, and there's nothing I can do to escape this. No, not this time. Maybe you can do it the, somehow do it in the 11th hour, just for the fun of it. No, we don't have enough energy still. I'm gonna go ahead and attack then. Let me see. I know there's no way I can escape next turn. I'm gonna smile, say well played. Put energy, put a choice man. Energy drive, take you out. One prize card away. One prize card away. But yeah, we got stuck. That's okay. He got stuck last. No, shut up, shut up. Good game, good game. That was a good game. Woo and there goes the arrows. This is UI. Good game, cave guy. Good game, good game, good game. Good game. Good. Game. good yeah. All right. So I'm satisfied. Moving on. Well, looks like you made it to the end. Thank you. Congratulations. It is time we rate this deck. So, let's break it down. A pound on. Well, I'll tell you what I really feel about this. Unique trait. Let's start with that. There isn't none. You're just a generic Pokemon. You got enough hit points. You got enough damage. That's why we were... Yeah, let's take him out for a spin today. And that's pretty much it. Nothing too bad or uh, too good about that. And we had enough to make it work, so we'll give it a 4 out of 5. Uh, damage. It's okay. It's a 4 out of 5 as well. You're going for a 2 shot. You have a 1 shot with this Lycanroc here. And you have a 1 shot here. They're very conditional, but I think that's what, you know, is balanced in this game. It's not. It's one shot spam, they say, city. Alright, but I'll talk about that another day. Set up. Setup is a problem in this deck. You don't get enough damage through a power down with the regular attack. You do get enough damage here, but it costs an extra energy, whereas the GX Pokemon would be more efficient. It's more liable, it's gonna stay around a little bit longer, so it's a slow hippo. A power on slow. Slower than other decks. So we're gonna give it a three out of five. Defense! Well, you're fighting with mostly a Poundons and Garbings. They can't use their Big giant KO and bigger, bigger expensive costs to take you down. Well, they can, but yeah, I think Sogaleo trying to take these down. It's just paying too much for one prize guard. It's gonna get stuck. So you get 4.5 bonus there, just a 0.5 bonus above normal because of uh, your one prize attackers. Finally, rating. You use C plus. Kapalon is not that great. I don't know. I would try to use it again, but the pal pass. 
is going to be in every fighting deck. I've got to go update them from now on. So, Hippalthos, you're a true winner. You are a true, true, true winner. All right, Garchomp, Buzzwall, you're going to welcome your new Hippo friend to the other deck. So, weakness is that the Hippos are slow, especially Hippalthos, not worth the... Uh, yeah, it's not worth it. You can pull it off, but it takes so much to pull it off. Uh, upgrades. I would take one and pound on deck off. Put like and rock if you really, really want to do this. It's not that great. So here's what it looks like. This is gonna be the final version. I don't think they might, they'll give you another reason to go back to this. So yeah, this is gonna be it. We're gonna take Paltos out and put a real Pokemon after this. So uh, that'll be it for another day, another stream, which hasn't happened yet. So, what am I serving you up uh, next time? Let me see. Ah, okay. I think we might have to do something good. Yeah, yeah, went with a silly deck. We're gonna have to go back and upgrade a very, very powerful deck. What I think is the strongest fairy deck is up for next time. Yeah. Where are you, man? It's one of you. You are the strongest fairy Pokemon. In terms of setup and speed and damage, let me show you how it's done next time. So, Xerneas uh, Rainbow Road is what it is called. Alright, we're going to update Rainbow Road next time. You're going to see the fantastic results. Just be quiet about that. That's up for next time. So, uh, I think it's tomorrow too. Yeah. Alright, thank you very much, Endergrowth and Frenchels. Uh, please like, subscribe. Push you go! Helps me out. And you want to see more videos like this. I stream live on Twitch. But unless you're in the loop, you won't know when that's happening. It's happening in the morning. Somewhere in the morning. My time. Yeah. Follow me on social media. I'll give you clues when new things are happening. And uh, my Discord link of chat is right above my head. Sins above my head too. That is it for now. Uh, covers. Yeah. New covers, which you're listening to, will be coming in May. And uh, we upgraded some recently in, uh, in February. Yeah, the acoustic versions are probably uh, released at a later time. But for now... That is it. Thank you very much, Integral Differentials. You guys take it easy. Stay safe. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.